Welcome back. It's time to play Thomas was alone once again. Uh, I genuinely have not been this keen to come back to a game in a very long time. This game is so good. If you don't know this, this is a 2011 puzzle platformer indie by indie developer Mike Ethel. Uh, I did suspect Martin Freeman was the narrator. It was instead Danny Wallace, who did a great job. Probably a bit cheaper too. <laughs> but I did get the actor right. <laughs> She'd need a cape. There was no getting around yeah. that. You SVO couldn't so be a good. superhero without a cape. Claire didn't want confusion. If you saw a cape, that made matters clear. You knew what you were dealing with. Claire was all about communication. And, you know, floating in water. Which was her superpower. Huh. Oh boy. Oh boy. So I know... Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. This is gonna be very funny if it works. Let's go! So I will say... Oh man, that's so cool. I will say one of the things... Oh, I can do the opposite. I do like that one of the unintentional things that happened was that oh it's an invisible wall there I was like is there something there I like that one of the unintentional things that happened was that I found I could move characters with other characters on top of me and just kind of thought it was fun but it's actually an intended thing for parts of the game which is really cool All right, bye, Claire. Oh, no, not bye, Claire. All right. Fear not, my skinny friends, for I am Claire, and I will save you. Oh, that's cool. Claire oh, that's needed really to come cool. up with a superhero name as soon as possible. Claire was rubbish. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have to... Yeah, I have to dismount one by one, but... God, the soundtrack in this game is so beautiful. Everything about this game is just correct. Come. Claire arrived just in time. Which oh was, of course, the perfect moment for superheroes to arrive. Huh. Oh. Can make it. Bonk. Water level goes up. Oh. Oh. Up we go. <laughs> That's cool. As the water began to rise, Claire vowed to save this little rectangle in as many restarts as it took. Hey, a meta commentary. Claire wondered if oh, no. Thomas would make a good sidekick. No. Or was she more the Lone Avenger type? Yeah, she'd like that. The sole hero in a world of rectangles and conveniently placed pools of toxic water. Oh. I thought I missed the thingy. It's fine. It is fine. Uh, the others told no. Claire that staircases were a bit of a fixture here. Claire wondered why the world made it so difficult. It is funny to see the tiny skinny character like yeet up the giant square character. That's true, actually. I was kind of hoping... Huh. Hang on. No. Maybe, actually. Hang on. Yeah, hang on. You'll see. There's a point. There's a reason. There's a reason. Let's go. <laughs> Oh no! 
Goodbye. <laughs> oh, whatever. Uh, I see what's happening here. Uh, how do we do this separately? Oh, wait. Hang on. Yeah, this is fine. Yep. You go here. You go here. You go here. Alright. Oh, whoops. Went the wrong way. Oh. It's no! Alright, it's fine. I wonder if that's why they put that there. Uh. Jump 800 times. What an achievement I just got. Claire I don't think that shows probably up. Probably needed but... a nemesis. A villain who would show their true colors at the worst possible moment, hurting all she held dear. Chris was the most obvious choice. He <laughs> seemed stroppy enough, and his jump was so pathetic that it conveniently avoided Claire's insecurities. Yes, Chris. Diabolical Chris. The fiendish Christopher. Chris or Chris is the only one that can fit here, by the way. Oh, maybe not even. <laughs> um. Huh. That doesn't work. I don't know what works. I think this is. Oh wait, can I just get up? Oh, easy peasy. That's cool. Oh, whoops. Oh. It didn't fix the problem. Well, it did, but... Not in the way... There we go. Wait, what? What happened? I don't know what happened. Uh, oh. 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 And then repeat. Yeah. Uh, man. Sometimes I wish it was slightly easier to select characters. But only sometimes. Oopsie. Could also just pay slightly more attention. Oh, also the bottom right also helps me if I pay attention. Oh. Wait. What? Where had Chris gone? Was he off somewhere? Plotting Claire's downfall? If Claire was honest, and she had to be because she was a superhero. This was a troubling turn of events. Still, there were reasonably sized bodies of water to cross. That is true. There are bodies of water to cross. Some of the water physics are kind of sick. All right. Oh, goodness. Everything's fine. Oh, this is annoying, but it's fine. Oh, that's cool. You can, uh, you can let them, they'll keep jumping. I mean, it makes sense, like, can't not go anywhere. It's nice that the momentum of the last character you jumped with stays after you move. We done? I guess Claire can't get up there anyway, so probably. Here. Oh. We are done. Ha! <laughs> uh, that doesn't work either, actually. Oh, it does. Wait, am I stuck? 
Mm, oh goodness, am I stuck? Wait, I might be stuck. No! Hang on. Oh no, I'm not. I'm not. Sorry. Big goofy, but figure it out. That would have been funny if I somehow got stuck. Moving platforms over water, eh? Claire's newly heightened senses told her that there were multiple paths across with various possible configurations of the little posse. That's cool. I do want to do this, if possible, because it seems like the most fun. I can't jump there, right? Oh, I don't need to. Nice. They were doing really well. Claire hoped she could get them all across. John was fully aware he could do this alone. Thomas hoped he'd never have to. <laughs> He's gonna kill John. Oh, maybe. Oh, I can't jump. Hang on. Let's just send it. It is fun that can't solve this. You can't solve this and like exit without all of them in somewhat set positions. Spikes, that's not ideal. Oh, it's just Claire. Claire was alone. Which was odd. Because she wasn't meant to be alone. Oh boy. She needed to be where there were rectangles to save. Uh. Being the only superhero in a given space kind of defeats the object. Spikes? That was new. Claire avoided them. She decided they were most likely her kryptonite. Not the rubbish red kryptonite either, the proper radioactive green stuff. I do not know enough Superman to understand that reference, unfortunately. Oh my god. No. That's not so bad at jumping. Ah! Oh. Oh, it's worth. Not exactly a tesseract. I guess not. Great band, though. Alright, that wasn't so bad. I did suspect worse. Wait. Again? <laughs> Oh, it is the same level. What the hell? The world was repeating. And this time Thomas was here. Claire felt something had gone wrong. There was a disturbance in the force. Ah! Something thank had altered goodness, the there's matrix. A respawn there. The world was reacting to their progress. It was amassing its forces. It was plotting against them. Oh. I made a mistake. Claire finally had a nemesis. Yay. Ah. Is this the same level? Like, sorry, I know it is the same level. Is it called? Was the last level called 2 9, or was it also called 2 10? There's no way to know. I'm guessing it was called 2 10, and I'm just playing 2 10 again. With Thomas. 2 10 B. But I wondered if that. Like, I imagine, naming convention wise, dang it. <laughs> that the game would call this the same number as the other level. Man, you gotta be real patient with old Claire here. Oh, goodness. Wait, what? Why am I sliding? All the sound... I mean, again, this game is holistically great. Why? Ah! You know what? You had to die. You had to die so you may live. I apologize. Alright, 
We'll re oh, yeah, we will respawn here too. Good thing too. Good thing too. <laughs> All right. Begin associations. Well, I guess this is another section. I guess every time there's a quote, it's another section. Huh. That seems suboptimal. Hello. Oh! Sideways, John. Oh. Oh. Laura was pleased this one was behind a wall. Maybe he'd never know what she could do. What can she do? Maybe, maybe they could just have a conversation. Hang out. As long as he didn't find out what she could do. Which would never happen so long as they stayed separate. Got bad news for you, Laura. I have a feeling you're about to not be separate soon. Nailed it. Laura didn't have time to worry about the ominous pixel cloud. Oh, it yeah, I did notice that. Some time and it had kept itself to itself until now. More important was the little orange ah! thing, which was looking at her in a way that she kind of, well, liked. Oh, that's so fun. That's sick. Oh, pixel cloud, very spooky. As the square, who had shyly introduced himself as Chris, bounced oh to top Laura, so fun. she began to worry that he was just using her like all the others had. They'd all bounce too, and then they disappeared when her back was turned. Oh. Oh. I was like, wait, it's unplayable. But then I realized there's a switch. It's like the perfect companion for Chris. Only the ominous pixel cloud ever remained, looking a little bigger and a little less hungry with every disappearing friend. What do you mean, disappearing? That doesn't sound optimal at all. With every bounce, Laura found herself less and less irritated by Chris. She started to miss him when he wasn't there. On another platform or something. Hang on. Alright. Trying to engage brain. Nice. Oh. I see. Oop. Mm. Careful now. What he was up to. Was he missing her? He wasn't saying very much. I mean, that's just Chris. You don't have to worry. Oh! It is a really... Hang on. Hang on. I just did that. Wait, no! Come on. Can I... I was like, there has to be a combination there. I do like that the flat object makes you Chris like design ways. Was in love. Makes you very she much want to. She was perfect. Oh no. He had to tell her so. Hang on. At some point, he Ow. would definitely tell her. I don't think he will. Probably best to wait for a moment. The large, ominous pixel cloud wasn't about though. Yes. Yeah. Probably best to wait. It's terrifying. Oh my goodness. I don't know if this is optimal or not, but it seems kind of fun. I 
guess this is the safe way to do it. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm just gonna play it safe. Anyway, what I was trying to say is that it's very clever use of design to have a flat character and just have your inclination be, well, I want to bounce on the flat character. Well, I want to get on top of the flat character because they're at least going to be able to... Is this actually the intended... Well, this is one of the routes, I'm sure. This seems slower than jumping. Yeah, this is way slower than jumping. Oh, that is funny. Edge of tomorrow's situation. Little time loop. Go mama, I've come to bargain. Okay, we're safe. Uh, yeah, it's just clever. That you're naturally gonna get on top of the flight character and the property of the flight character is bouncing. Part of the problem. Uh, look, you're not wrong. Uh, John has to go in there, I think. Yep. Chris now what? was massively disappointed Whoa. to run into the gang again. He'd uh, enjoyed the alone time with his new girlfriend. Uh. Oh. Hang on. Just, uh, ah! So many shapes. Let's just let Thomas do it. That picture cloud. Spooky. I don't like it. My game was so vibes oriented. Why are you doing this to me? Uh, I think that's a Chris angle, right? Yep. Wait, why did John stop? That's weird. Was it too early to refer to Laura as his girlfriend? Only if I say it out loud, he told himself. He didn't want to scare her off. Why did John stop, I wonder? Holy smokes, I'm popping! That's fun. Nice little introduction to each character's strength and in general interactions are. Stop. And the bouncing is. Where is. Oh, it's there. I was about to ask where Laura's exit is, but she's lying on it. The others seem suspicious of Laura and the eager-looking pixel cloud of death which seemed to be watching her. Sure, they'd use her inherent bounciness to reach slightly higher jump points, but they wouldn't strike up a conversation with her. Chris found them rude. Rude? And always there. <laughs> Whoa, that was interesting. Never mind. I thought I did something cool, but... Uh... I didn't. I mean, it was still fine, but it wasn't that cool. Gotta move on, Chris. Look at him go. Oh. Can Laura make this? I think the answer is no. Let's do this. Oh, you can just even do it platformer style. You don't even have to, sorry, like elevator style? You don't even have to come, come. jump. As funny as that would be. All four are back. Also, I don't know where Claire went. What is this? The others wouldn't drop it. Who's that cloud guy? Why is he following us? What's that rumbling hungry sound he keeps making? Chris, can we just Whoa. leave Laura behind? Oh, goodness. Save me. Okay, good enough. Um, I don't have to do this elevator cycle, but... Rude. Guess I will. Everyone has to get here? That seems challenging. Alright, let's figure this out. Everybody has to bounce on... Wait. Hang on. Um... Wait, how does... Okay, so... Oh my goodness. My assumption is that... John will have to get on... No, no, no. Other way. No, 
no, no, no, no. My assumption is that... Wait, I can't jump with... Oh, this is gonna get interesting. Okay, I thought I could jump under a character, but that's not true. So we're gonna have to do something like this. Uh, hang on. Yep. Oh, so close. Can I, like, do this? Yeah, I guess. I mean, that's as tall as Thomas can get right now. And that's not tall enough. Uh, no. That isn't helpful. Also, how am I gonna get on there? Can I, like, do a run-up? Oh my goodness, this seems very complicated. Uh... So... It's like this kind of stuff, but I don't think that's gonna get me there, right? No, that doesn't really get me there. I'm trying to figure out, like, I assume I have to make a little step ladder. But I'm just trying to figure out how to do that. Oh, okay, never mind. Elevators. <laughs> uh, here. Oh, should have moved Chris. Am I gonna get picked up? Not from there. Okay. Uh, I think Thomas and John can make it on their own. Alright, here we go. Oh, this will help Chris, I guess. Nice. He's going to need Laura's help again. I I was actually wondering why there was holes in the ground, and now I know. This also means I can maybe do something funny. I don't think I'm going to get close enough. Yeah. Hang on, how do I get Laura up a level? Like that? Oh yeah, good enough. And then, hang on. Now what? <laughs> no. Okay, yep. I figured it out, I think. I think I don't need John or Thomas. Oh. Nice. Okay. Gonna move you in. Gonna move Thomas in just to save me some time. Also, it might be able to help Chris without Laura then. And then as this comes up, then over we go again. And then this will happen. Oh! Oh, okay. Never mind. Wow, that was complicated. It wasn't that bad, actually. It was mostly, like, about paying attention. Now I have to build stairs, I think? Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, uh, a little closer. Wait, have we figured out this doesn't work already? Wait. Ow. I think this works. Nope. That's frustrating. That works. That almost works, actually. <laughs> Can I... Almost. I think... No. Like, I'm trying to see if I can... 
then everyone has to get on here and then jump off which should be fine but we'll I have to get on there first oh wait hang on I'm trying to think about this how how just how It's like just sh too short. I feel like I'm missing something very obvious. Maybe not. Like my thought is I'm on the middle tallest one. Can I stack? the short one and the middle tall one on top of each other and then get on top of that because that would be high enough because I don't think yeah Thomas and Chris aren't even the same height as John not even close actually the problem is I don't know if I can do that like where would I go right because I have to get off here let me demonstrate. Maybe. So I'm here. So this would be here. This would be here. Oh, never mind. I am dumb. Is that enough? No. Uh, this will be enough. Okay. I was right. I just didn't think about it enough. This looks dangerous. Ah, holy! Is that intentional? That is the funniest thing I've ever seen if that's intentional. And I'm doing it again. Pew! Oh, okay. Uh, it was not intentional. For anyone wondering. That was cool. A little glitch. Thomas can make this right. Yeah, alright. We're good. On. Huh. Oh no! I failed. Can I? Oh goodness. Ah, this. I'm just gonna wait. That's fine. All that noise there. Uh, can Thomas jump on top of John? This works. Uh, maybe not actually. Oh my god, stop. Oh, it hurts. Alright. It stopped hurting. Claire's back. Oh, we have lots of characters. Where is John here? Wow, I have to get... Oh no. I have to get... Okay, hang on. Let me hit the switch. Oh. Uh, get moving, Thomas? Yeah. Did... Oh, I think I know what's going on. That's all I get. Okay. Can I get you in there? No, it's Chris only. Laura liked her new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. These ones seem oh, to be no. sticking around too. Oh no. Like those losers from before. Oh no. Everyone died. <laughs> Alright, so it's like a timed elevator situation. John is just vibing at top. Uh, okay, this will stop. So let's not deplane. Um, Laura liked her Thomas. new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. Cool. These ones seem to be sticking around too. Not like those losers from before. 
then that will get John up. And hopefully... It doesn't cause any problems. Why can I not get any further? Huh. That seems to be... What I would call mildly problematic. Oh, so there's no respawn in this level, which is interesting. Okay, hang on. Everybody off. Everybody off. Somewhat carefully. No bouncing. Can Claire come up? Oh, baby. It's pretty high. Alright. Also, no one can get in the water. That doesn't do anything. I didn't expect it to. Um, how do I get... I can't help but feel like the water was supposed to go up more. I'm going to restart this level and see if something changes. Feels like it was supposed to get. Laura liked her new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. These ones seem to be sticking around too. Not like those losers from before. Yeah. Oh yeah, well, the level actually just broke. Kind of. Interesting. I wonder what broke it. Oh, this should be somewhat straight. I'm gonna regret saying that in just a moment. Wait. Me, Thomas. Yes. Yes. Dang it. Uh, hang on. Come on. I mean, hang on. Hang on. Yeah, this is. Oh, goodness. Let's go. It's so funny to see Claire being bounced around. Oh, no. What am I trying to do here? Let's move John out of the way. Will this work? Maybe. Uh, yeah, what I'm trying to do might work, actually. Nope. Alright. What was I thinking? What was I cooking? I was cooking something. Uh, hang on. Will that work? Oh my god, that's so funny if that works. Hang on. Bring me closer. I want to hit them with my sword. Oh, that's totally going to work. I don't know if it's the intended solution, but it is funny. Uh, yeah, that's really funny. I don't think that's the intended solution, but what a hoot. You here. You here. You here, and... Oh. Nice. Come. Okay. <sighs> this is getting a wild. I... Well, let's click this, I guess. The cloud was getting closer. It was spending more and more time hovering around. Laura could tell it was making the others uncomfortable.
It's making me uncomfortable, to be honest. Oh, this level is miss May is way smaller than I thought. Oh baby. Wait, misplay. No! Anything but the spikes. I forgot about the spikes. Uh, this will be fine. Hmm. Other one, I guess? Yeah. I think it's just easier. Wait for the cycle. Select the right character. Nice. And then Thomas should be able to get there comfortably on his own. Well, comfortably. Yeah, this works actually. Nice. Okay. I think we found yet another point where we can stop down. Such a sweet game though. Like, definitely getting harder, but I don't know. Really fascinating game. The vibes are immaculate. Atmosphere is excellent. Really using my brain too to solve a bunch of puzzles. And now we get to bounce, so hard to complain. Thanks for joining me for Thomas's Alone. Uh, come hang out next time. I'll definitely be back shortly with this game because it's very good.